Hello and welcome to the session. I am Asha and I am going to help you with the following question which says ABCD is a rectangle in which diagonal AC bisects angle A as well as angle C show that first ABCD is a square second diagonal BD bisects angle B as well as D. So here in this question we are given a rectangle in which the diagonal AC bisects angle A as well as C. So this implies angle DAC is equal to angle CAB and angle DCA is equal to angle BCA. So first let us write down what we are given. So we are given a rectangle ABCD. in which angle DAC is equal to angle BAC and angle DCA is equal to angle BCA. And we have to prove first that ABCD is a square. So, let us begin with the proof. Now, in triangle ADC and triangle ABC, angle DAC is equal to angle BAC. This is given. Also angle DCA is equal to angle BCA and AC is equal to CA. This side is common to both the triangles. Therefore by AC congruence condition triangle ADC is congruent to triangle ABC which implies AD is equal to AB and DC is equal to BC. This is by CTCT that is corresponding parts of congruent triangles are equal. Also, ABCD is a rectangle so this implies opposite sides are equal that is AD is equal to BC and AD is equal to DC. Now, from this and this, we conclude that AB is equal to CD and CD is equal to BC and BC is equal to DA. This implies all the four sides of this rectangle are equal. This implies that ABCD is a square. So this completes the first part. And now in the second part we have to prove that diagonal BD bisects angle B as well as angle D. That is, we have to show that angle ABD is equal to angle CBD, these two angles, and 
angle ADB and angle CDB are equal. Now let us consider triangle BCD and triangle BAD. Now in these two triangles, side AD is equal to BC. Since ABCD is a square and all the sides of a square are equal, also AB is equal to BC. Again since ABCD is a square and all the sides of a square are equal, so these two sides are also equal. And BD is equal to DB. This is common to both the triangles. Therefore, by SSS congruence condition, Triangle BCD is congruent to triangle BAD, which further implies that angle ABD is equal to angle CBD and angle ADB is equal to angle CDB. This is by CPCT, that is. Corresponding parts of congruent triangles are equal, which further implies that diagonal BD bisects angle B as well as angle T. So, this completes the session. Take care and have a good day.